Hey everyone, it's Lisa, and today is Wednesday, hump day. And I decided today, I had made a list, when I was doing my Nordstrom shopping, I made a list of the things that I saw that are some of my favorite things that I already have that are on sale. And there was just a few of them that were really good deals and things that I really, really like that I think are special. So I thought today I would do that because I know the sale is getting ready to go public. I think, is it tomorrow? Tomorrow or Friday? It's coming up soon. And goodness, Brooke has been just tracking that order of hers. Her Nordstrom order comes today, and I had ordered a few more things. We've put in a couple of orders. Oh, it's, it's terrible. And so I will um, maybe do that. I don't know if I'll get a chance tomorrow, but anyway, I'll show you maybe on Friday, and I'll show you what get, she gets too. So um, I wrote down faves you could get that I already have. Okay, so um, I know the T3 blow dryer is on there. I know um, I brought this. <laughs> my This is one of my all-time favorite bras. I found out about this bra because I saw a picture of, I think Sarah Jessica Parker was in one of my magazines. I believe it was Marie Claire. And this is her favorite bra. And she likes to wear it like when it shows because it's so pretty. But it is just a beautiful T-back bra. It's um, called Notori Feathers. And look how pretty the back is. I hope you can see that. Um, it's just got a beautiful, beautiful, here I'll do it where it's not showing so it's got a beautiful design but even better than that it's got a really nice catch right here in the front and it's not it's got just enough padding it's not like bulletproof or anything and i'm um, here let me i never know how far to zoom in okay now maybe you can see the design a little bit better but i love this bra and i wear it all the time adjustable and then they also have it in a regular bra and I'm halfway thinking about getting that but I just bought those other ones but um, anyway I think this would be a great deal to get and I get my normal size um, 34 double D and I love it so that was one of the things that I wanted to tell you about um, hanky panky boy shorts of course I'm not going to show you mine I don't show you anything any underwear or panties if they've been worn but um, the Hanky Panky Boy Shorts are some of my favorites. I love to sleep in those. And that is what John loves. His favorite thing for me to sleep in are the Hanky Panky Boy Shorts and just like a white tank top. That's like the his favorite thing, you know. <laughs> I won't go any further. Okay, um, so Notori Feather Bra. Um, the T3 blow dryer, the T3 single pass flat iron, but I really think that I prefer in the flat iron, I think I prefer the GHD. And I believe, yes, the GHD one inch is available on the sale. Now I bought the platinum version and I really, really do like it. Um, so, but I do think the one inch is good too. That's what Brooke uses. I just think the GHD, it heats up faster. It doesn't get past a certain temperature, and um, I love that it has automatic shutoff. So if you're in the market for a um, flat iron, that is on sale. Okay, I tried to bring stuff upstairs. My cashmere mist deodorant. I believe it's like buy three for some price, and I didn't get it because I thought, do I really want three of them? But I think I am gonna order it because Ulta quit selling this, and so I've had to start getting it at Belk or Dillard's, which is further away. So I think I'm going to go ahead and order that. This is the best. This is right up there with prescription strength, you know, deodorant and antiperspirant. It is an antiperspirant, and I love it. And it smells good, but don't think that the smell is going to... It doesn't linger, and it doesn't compete with your fragrance. So don't worry about that, but it does smell good. It's, I mean, I've gone through, I don't know how many of those, and it lasts forever. They actually say a lot of men use this because it works so well. So that's one of my favorites. Um, okay, so they had some sunglasses, because you know I checked out the sunglasses. I love the Gucci Aviators. 
that is a good deal on those and I'm trying to hold back not getting those but this is a pair that Denise sent me and it's from Les Specs and this is called the Prince and these are really cool looking now sorry you'll be able to see my ring light in these but I love these and this is that new trend where it's the super flat lens and these just fit so well and I love these these are some of my favorite funky aviators and um, I noticed that they were on the sale they're just really pretty very simple it's like they're just gold and then that you know dark greenish color so they're like very very classic in the way that they're the color is but um the fact that they're so flat like that um they remind me of like the gentle monster uh, sunglasses and stuff that's just very in right now and i love this case okay and then another style of sunglasses that i love they're on sale are the quay or key sorry key it's a, just a bad habit that's hard to break um, the key sunglasses in needing fame and i bought these in two different colors i love this clear and it has like the um I always forget what that is called. I always want to say variegated, but it has the lens that goes from dark to light. And these are really big. These are so cool. These, I think, look great with a faux fur coat. They just give you that 60s, 70s vibe, you know? And they're very, very, very light. So those are the clear ones, and then here are the black ones. And I love these too. Mine are very dirty. I'm bad about wearing them, wearing them, and then sticking them in my drawer and not cleaning them. But um, I love both of those. Very light, very easy to wear. If you're someone like me that doesn't like your sunglasses to touch your cheeks, all of these are good because they have the nose pieces. So those are something else that I saw when I was going through. Um, the Zella High waist leggings and i believe zella live in leggings anyway zella you guys know if you've been with me i went through a whole i bought i think every pair of leggings that are i was going to say famous but um well known or popular i think i bought all the best-selling leggings i bought the lululemon i bought the um zella I bought um, just every pair. I can't even remember. I know I got Hugh and I got, I know I got all the expensive ones. And I really like the Zella the best. Those are the ones that when I'm going through my legging drawer, I pull those out. Oh, and the other ones are, um, it's the guy's name. I do like those. Oh, I'll put it down here so I don't have to think about it. Waste too much time. David Lerner. I do like those too. But Zella are the ones that I go for. They just are. They're my favorites. Okay, the Clarisonic Mia is on special, and I love the Radiance head. I believe that's what it's called, Radiance. Okay, this was the biggest thing, and this is what made me, when I was going through for Brooke, we ended up ordering her a few more things or something else. When I was going through it and I saw this, I was like, I cannot forget to tell them about this. This jacket, this leather jacket that is gorgeous. Well, it's faux leather, and it's the blank NYC embroidered faux leather jacket. It looks so good with everything. I love it. Like, even with, like, this slip dress. Here, let me zoom out a little bit so you can see. But look how pretty it looks, even with a dress. It just has the perfect silhouette, and that embroidery is just amazing. I get so many compliments on this jacket. I mean, people will write down where I got it, and I just love it. So, oh, I miss wearing my leather jackets. But, um, so, right now while I'm standing up, I might as well do my outfit. This is that dress that I bought from Shopbop from their sale. And I believe it's still on sale. That sale was just kind of like sale on top of sale. But I love it. I think it fits so nicely. Um, I've got on my yummy tummy shaping thongs underneath it, which kind of smooth you out and um, just not too much cleavage, 
I mean, it's just beautiful. And it's available in a couple, couple of different colors. And um, so I really wanted to, this is the main thing I didn't want to forget to tell you about. Okay. Okay, so let me go down my um, list so I don't forget anything. And I wrote down the GHD 1-inch Styler. Um, Rebecca Minkoff Backpack, the Julian Backpack. I sold my backpack that I had, my Rebecca Minkoff one, and I semi-regret it. I loved that purse, and I would not hesitate to get another one if I see another color. Mine was black. I remember I took it to New York, and I loved it. And I'm real bad about when I'm through with something, thinking... I, don't, I won't want to use it again. And then when it's something that I really liked, then I'm like, oh, I, maybe I would have used that again. But anyway, I love the Julian backpack. Now, I, it's not a backpack backpack for like school or anything because Brooke and I were actually looking through all the backpacks to see if she wanted something for back to school. And we didn't see anything that good. But um, I do love it. And I believe they even have like a velvet one. So I wanted to tell you that. Okay, and I've already kind of mentioned this the other day, but the Trish McAvoy planner and their brush set. If I did not have so many brushes, I would get that brush set because Trish McAvoy is known for her brushes. I believe, I probably shouldn't say this because it's probably wrong, but I could have sworn that maybe she came out with the brushes first. I'm not sure, but anyway, this is what a planner is, and you get so much stuff for the money. Now, I don't know, um, I'm, I think this is one that I've kind of put together, but you know, it always comes with like a liner, um, a mascara, all kinds of stuff, and then it has these little pages that you are, that are magnet, and you can add, this is my favorite one of all times here. This has got the Blackberry granite. You can see how much I've used. And, um, gosh, I need to use that more. I might leave this out just so I can use it tomorrow. But I love her shadows. And um, I think a lot of you would really like this. I mean, she's known for that and for her brushes. Let's see, updates to the things that I bought and showed you. Because, I, you know, I showed them to you the day that I got them. Um, the bralette that I got, I can wear it, but it is my straps are screaming for help. So I'm not going to send it back. I don't know if I might try to make it work or keep it for a backup or give it to a friend or something. But that medium and that little bralette, if your boobs are just a little bit smaller, then it'll be perfect. Mine was just a little bit stretched, but we'll see. And um, let's see what else was I thinking that, um, goodness, let me go to my um, list of stuff that I showed you. Oh my goodness, that YSL lip set. Gorgeous. I love that so much. That's like one of the best things that I got. Um, oh, here are the bobble bar earrings. Not the bobble bar, but the these are the Kate Spade, I think. Are these the Kate Spade? Yes, I believe these are the Kate Spade earrings. I love these, they're so pretty on. And like with this dress today, they're just perfect. They have a real long post. I love an earring with a long post and good backs to keep them on nicely. So I love those. Um, let's see, the retro thong, I love those. The Calvin Klein bra fit beautifully. Um, that commando bodysuit, you guys know how much I love it, and I will be talking about that in a future haul. AG jeans, um, everything. Um, shoes, the mink off bag, the Adidas leggings. You guys know I love the Hue leggings. So everything. The only thing that was the least bit um, not perfect is that black bralette. But I think most of you probably know how that goes anyway. Okay, and then another thing I wanted to show you today because I have worn it like three times now and I feel like I need to show it to you before I put it on Instagram or whatever. Denise, my friend, sent me another one of these Nude Envy lipsticks. These things are beautiful. And this one is the color Naked. The other one I have is Mesmerize. And this is what I have on today. And I have it on with 
Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Lip Liner. That is a must have. If you do not have Pillow Talk, you need it. It will work for anyone. It is just like a lighter, more pinker version of Lancome. I love it. It's just instant lips. And then this is the Naked and it has just a little bit of a, I wouldn't even say shimmer, but um, kind of like a glimmer. It's just beautiful. I mean, these lipsticks are just phenomenal. And I know I keep saying I want to order every color, and I do, and then I don't do it. But, oh, I mean, that is so pretty. And you could put that with so many different lip liners, and you could layer this over so many different things Let, um let's see and oh my lion ring this is the hear me roar and these are on my website everybody that has gotten these has loved them and i've had some people ask if we can get a bigger size i'm not sure because you know what she made is already made so i will mention it though because it is adjustable on the inside i believe it goes from a size five to seven um, but I love him. It's a really cool ring. So I think that's it. Um, here is our girl. She just came over to see us. What do you think, Chanel? You want to get up here? Is that jacket in your way? Okay, she's got to jump down and see it. <laughs> so I hope you guys have a good day, and I will be back Friday um, with my haul video and updates and all that kind of good stuff too. So have a good one and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.